Is it right to go to a fortune teller or to use a water diviner in order to get answers? And the question is very simple. Uh, I'll start with the water diviner. I, um, I've been asked this question by numerous people, and I'm not pointing fingers and I'm not judging, but I'm telling you what happened on this farm. We went to a geologist. So we got all the technical advice we could. And then we got to the family, got together, and we prayed. And then he said to me, anywhere in this line, in 200 meters, there's water. And I really prayed about it. I took a peg, and I went and I put the peg in the ground. And we got the, um, the driller to come with his machinery. And we drilled, and we got beautiful water. Um, before I was a believer, that's right. They tell me that if you get two pieces of eight-gauge wire... And you walk along, and uh, where there's water, they'll cross and they'll pull down. Same with a willow stick. I've done that. But it's not, it's not in the Bible. It's, uh, it's not acceptable. And uh, we need to do what Jesus has told us to do. So I want to tell you that. And when it comes to tarot cards, fortune telling, to me it's just a thumb suck. I don't believe in it. We need to go again to the Word of God, and the Lord will show us through the Word, reading the Bible systematically, also, through a prophet, through a man that you respect, a man of God, he will pray about it and he will tell you what he believes God's shown you, and then you make the decision.